Hey guys, Chris Lacey here and I'd like to quickly run you through the new features of Action Launcher 1.8. Let's start with shutters. Shutters are an exclusive Action Launcher feature that allow you to drag an app to your home screen and with just a single swipe, automatically display the widget for that app. In Action Launcher 1.8, shutters have been extended in three key ways. You can now change the widget that appears in a shutter. Just click the Change Widget button, select your widget, and that's it. In this case, I'm applying the sound search widget to the Google shortcut. Secondly, you can apply a shutter to any app shortcut, whether that app has a widget or not. Just pick up and put down a shortcut, select Create Shutter, and you're on your way. And thirdly, shutters are now available for ice cream sandwich users. Version 1.8 also sees the ability to increase the grid size to 12 by 12 for phones and tablets alike, as well as adjusting an icon scale. Exporting layouts to an SD card has also been added. I find this feature quite handy to very quickly jump between a few different preset layouts. In this case, I'm quickly jumping to this dialer layout that I've been trialling. Also in 1.8, a handy shortcut has been added where swiping up on a home screen will reveal a recents window. And for those that might have missed it, Action Launcher also recently gained support for dragging apps and widgets from the quick draw to the home screen. Google's new hamburger button animation has been integrated to the action bar. You can apply icon packs, disable wallpaper scrolling, there's full 7 inch and 10 inch tablet support, and a whole lot more. So that's Action Launcher 1.8. It's available now in the Play Store, so check it out. See you later.